You would think by now that I'd be bored of exploring gorgeous places, but you would be wrong. Welcome to the shrine of Hazrat Ali in Mazari Sharif, northern Afghanistan. This is absolutely breathtaking. So we've seen the Sakhi Shrine in Kabul, we've seen the Blue Mosque in the city of Herat, but the scale of this place just hits different, man. Honestly, this place is unlike anything I've ever seen. So apparently this place is a tomb for the fourth Caliph of Islam, Ali. Up here you can see the Arabic text that says Ali, and this place apparently was built in 1488, which makes it almost 550 years old, which is just breathtaking to think about, like, it's in such good condition. Man, the sun is glaring here. I apologize for my eyes. But look behind me. It appears as though there's sort of some uh, reconstruction work going on, which is good to see. It's good to see that, um, at least in northern Afghanistan, that the historical sites are being maintained. Wow, that's pretty cool, man. Yeah, and you can see here there's sort of uh, parts of the structure falling away. Um, and up on the roof as well, there's a little bit of erosion beginning to happen. Oh yeah, and here you can definitely see where it's uh, starting to decay, unfortunately, but hopefully the restoration work will restore that. And there are just so many separate little sections to this place as well, like tiny little rooms, different entrances, and all of them are like designed slightly differently. It's just incredible to look at. Like this place here, it's just a sort of little undercover area, I guess. I don't know if this is a shrine um, or a tomb for anyone in particular, but yeah, it's just amazing, man. Check out these gorgeous ornate doors on the entrance to this place as well. This one's sealed shut, but the other one we can go through. And just the detail up here as well, all carved out of stone and wood. Yeah, this place is really special. We've actually just been inside to the tomb itself, the tomb of Ali. Um, a couple of Taliban were giving us a bit of trouble about filming inside, but we managed to get a little bit of footage. And so this is it, this is the tomb of Ali. And you can see the tomb is sort of gilt with these gorgeous sort of gold details and silver details as well. I wouldn't be surprised if these were all solid, uh, solid gold and solid silver. And there are these incredible sort of decorative glass chandeliers available inside as well. Yeah, wow man, this place is absolutely breathtaking. I can't believe the height of the ceiling as well. Like all the way to the top, that must be like 60 or 70 meters. And the detail in the painting goes all the way up to the top. And on your first time around, there's all these awesome little details that you'd never even pick up on, like this plaque here, carved out of white marble. And you've got um, another one here. I'm not going to go and translate them, but they look gorgeous. That is probably going to do us for today. My phone is overheating and I'm sweating like crazy. But if you enjoyed this video and you want to see more of the incredible historical sites available in Afghanistan, do like, follow and subscribe. Until next time.